the players trotting out onto the pitch, the mosaic absolutely astonishing now as the players are out there, led out by the match referees. The Barcelona anthem rings around this massive stadium. This is the Clásico, this is the biggest match in world football. Have a listen to the Camp Nou sing. Now you can hear the a cappella version ringing around the stadium. What a fantastic image this mosaic is. Here's the Barca lineup. Uh, in goal, it's Mark andre Ter Stegen. At the back, Sergio Roberto at right back, Jordi Alba. At the back, Nacho, Veran, Ramos, Marcelo. In midfield, Casemiro, Modric, Cruz, and Isco. And up front, Gareth Bale and Karim Benzema. On the bench for Real Madrid today. You have to stay fit. Real Madrid get it underway, attacking the goal to the left of your screens very casually. Casemiro plays it out to Nacho, returns it to the didn't go through to Rafinha, collected by Isco. Isco finding Benzema, but the flag up for an offside position against the Coutinho. The flag stays down, Coutinho looks up, overhits the cross, Rafinha was lurking on the far appearance. And uh, to get the opportunity to feel the ball at his feet, get some confidence. With... Intercepted and chested down. Suarez making a run, Alba sees him, so too does Varane and intercepts. Fortunate. Casemiro in problems. Coutinho's cross keeps the ball in play. Looks up, gets the cross in. It may fall to Benzema on the left foot. The first shot of the game. It's too high. It's off target. It doesn't trouble. It was there unmarked. Philippe Coutinho to side foot it past Thibaut Courtois. It's 1 0 to Barcelona. Real Madrid with grim looking faces as Barcelona. Losing in the game, he can become a liability. It's Suarez. Oh, a lovely little layoff. Coutinho collects it. Rafinha's in the area too. Still, Kudrich gets away from his Croatian national uh, side companion. Rapid confidence now. Rafinha, he's got Sergio Roberto outside him. Sergio Roberto's crossed to the far post. A little bit over hit. Coutinho brings it under control just. Nacho sticking to him. But it seems he's got more of an eye on Alba to try and stop him. Benzema taking on PK. Now he's sticking to the task. Find Steve Aston him and sprint and go into space even when he's playing auxiliary and closing things down. Marcelo has a go. Awkward for Mark Andre Ter Stegen. It bounced. The jerk miss hit really towards Isco. Suarez goes down under the challenge of Ramos and his brilliant. In the risky ball, it falls. And what a save from Courtois. Astonishing save from Courtois. That would have been Arthur's first classical goal. Modric bullied off the ball illegally, according to the referee by Sergio Busquets. That comes from the shot, came from him. And finally, it's played out by Rakitic, who finds Rafinha, and Casemiro with the foul. The referee wants the pick to be taken quickly, I can only assume. I find that absolutely bewildering. Nacho, and he can't get the cross in. Tony Cruz, Benfima to Marcelo. He'll lose the ball, I'll turn and build again. Just smart. Sergio Roberto combining superbly with Suarez. And Varane, Rafinha nods it on. Ramos intercepts, tries a shot. It may have stung the gloves, but straight at Marc-Andre Ter Stegen. That all came from a loose ball from Clement Langley. Alba, first time ball into Suarez. Down he goes, the referee has a look. Play continues. Alba to keep things going. Here's Busquets, Alba again, the flag up for offside. Now the crowd absolutely demanding the referee um, consult on this one. Well, as, as, as we can say again, just to emphasise what we've been taught about VAR, if anybody in the crowd is expecting VAR. Courtois, up step Suarez! 2-0 to Barcelona! Calm as you like from the Uruguayan. He's got a message under the shirt. I don't know if you can read that, Duncan or Graham. Oh, it's for his third child who, okay. was a, who arrived, I think, on Monday of this week. Welcome, he says, to Welcome. his young daughter. Absolutely. <laughs> didn't think he was going to get there and score. He did the right thing. He caused a foul. Hats off. Barca's at the... arms and big hands. Meanwhile, here's Coutinho, Duncan, getting into the area. 
And winning a corner, some of the more enthusiastic fans felt it might have been a handball appeal. The referee quick to point to the corner flag. Just going back. Bale gets away from Sergio Roberto, brought down by Gerard Piquet, free kick to Real. Nacho kept it going, Isco, again Sergio Roberto with a crucial, crucial interception, just got the slightest of touches on that. Piquet's down, stays down from him, picks out Alba, Alba looks up, gets the cross in! And Suarez seemed almost to hesitate there, Graham. As that he was going with it. his right boot instead of if he's been yeah. charging. He's got Isco with him to his right. Instead, he finds Bale. Bale loses his footing. And here's Rafinha. Alba making a sprint. And Rafinha overhits the... Well, it's got to be the right touch. Still Barcelona on the attack. After Arzo had won a 50-50. Benzema with the headed clearance finds Marcelo. In the better of Ramos. It's a beautiful cross. <laughs> and the header collected by Thibaut Courtois. The reason he crossed it in there was that the man trying to close him down that he lost was Sergio Ramos, so there was no, there was no centre half to partner Varane. Rafinha with a shot. Oof. There's a sense that Madrid are there for the taking right now. It was Gerard Piquet on the far post. Isco. And on the assistance, Cruz swings it in. Headed clear by Swanev. Position, options to his left. And he does neither one thing, Steve R. To the Cam, no. Plenty of Barcelona fans there enjoying themselves as well. They might, it's 2-0 at half-time. The Madrid players in the tunnel not looking quite so happy. Could this well be the last opportunity to save them? Sergio Roberto had an excellent first half. Now Rakitic is going to have a shot. Didn't catch it. It'll be a goal kick. Barcelona to get an early shot in the first seconds of the first half just to show their intent again. Try and get him out of this mess he's got himself into. It's just like Benzema and Bale who can head it. Marcelo's cross is a good one and Lenglet did live. Suarez, plenty of blue and red shirts with him. He mm. tries to lay it off and uh, just catches more intent here from Madrid. Lucas plays it in short to Isco, across the face of the goal, comes to Marcelo, and Marcelo gets one back for Real Madrid. Marcelo, it had to be, it's 2-1. Third goal in three games for the Brazilian defender, and if you look at the moment, when he profits from the chaos, he takes a touch off either his belly or his chest, just to change the angle so that he's got a shot on goal. That's the type of improvisation you get from Marcelo. It's really cleverly finished, Barcelona out sixes and sevens, the ball in from Isco is really clever, it's not defended particularly well. Look at that touch. That's the touch that opens up a minute piece of room so that he can score and make it 2-1. A combination from Benzema and Bale. Benzema with plenty of intention there. Uh, Lucas did well, I felt. And uh, Marcelo's uh, finish uh, at pleasure, really, Steve. Yeah, well, he takes it brilliantly across the player, takes it on between his chest and his, his belly, just pushes it across. Um, Piquet, I think, that was coming out, opened the angle up for him and, and he sticks it away. Well, that's just the kind of start to the second half uh, Madrid would have been looking for. Rakitic play on, says the referee. Swadiv trying to square it. And it will be a Barcelona corner. And he's going to have a word and perhaps a car. Straight into the hands of Thibaut Coel. Lucas to the right. And Benberto puts the cross in. Gareth Bale blocked by Clement Langley. Piquet towards Gareth Bale, he brings it back, it's headed out by Rakitic, Benzema miscues to Marcelo, Marcelo's cross, looking for Bale, finding the head in the end of Ramos, and yep. Busquets gives it away to Cruz, Cruz finds Bale, it comes to Modric, off the base of the post, Ter Stegen absolutely rooted to... Cuts it back to Isco, danger here, Isco miscuing it, and it wills it to find Isco, who in turn picks out Benzema, Benzema turning, trying the cross. Isco with the cross. It's headed clear for another corner by Ivan Rakitic. Crosses to the far post, overhits this. Sergio Roberto making a run. Rakitic sees him! Oh, oh. the post from Suarez. Tremendous play from Football Club Barcelona there. All credit to Ivan Rakitic and to Sergio Roberto, and still the attack continues. Busquet inside to Isco. Isco's cross blocks by... Comes to Tony Cruz. Oh, Cuts safe. inside to Isco. Gerard Piquet with a block. It'll be a corner. No, no, it won't. Still Coutinho. That's a good ball in. And so close. Deflected wide by the captain again, I'm pretty sure. If it was, then it's an absolutely superb save, George. I thought again. Lays it in for Coutinho. He whips the cross in. 
Falls nicely for Swadev. Still Swadev, and uh, in the end, if I wants it, in comes the cross. Ooh. Benzema over the top. I'm, I'm telling you right now, it's absolutely unbelievable. Lucas twice now has just gone for a little hide. He stood in the touchline, hiding in plain view. Not one of the Barca te technical staff, not one of the Barca defence. I've said Jordi Alba has got over. Isco. Marcelo. Advantage, Mark. Rakitic. Sergio Roberto. No. Ramos with the cross, advantage Mark andre This time he feeds it wide to Sergio Roberto. Sergio Roberto with other options. Oh, there it is. Suarez, Suarez with the goal. What a header. 3-1 to Barcelona against the run of play. Luis Suarez, the man who does it. Dembélé with the break, with the layoff to Sergio Roberto. He cuts it back, and Suarez's header, Steve, is the header of a real goal scorer. It was a fabulous header, he's adjusted to it. But the break comes from Dembele. When you see Dembele running from midfield, they start to back off because they know he's got real pace. So they back off, leave the space open. Of course, from Marcelo, little cheeky back heeler to Isco. Isco's crossed to the far post. Sprinting forward, Piquet wants a Classico goal. But lays it off, and uh, the shot from Mark Ramos, taking advantage of to set Suarez through. Oh, his hat-trick! 4-1 to Barca, hat-trick for Luis Suarez. Steve Archibald, that is rising to the occasion. That is assuming the mantle of responsibility in the absence of Leo Messi. Look at the face of Ramos, there's no coming back from this. Absolutely no coming back time. It's a sublime finish from Suarez. All the cool in the world you can imagine you would expect from a Barcelona top striker. Take it straight up to the keeper, Courtois, one of the best in the world, just clips over him, cool as you like. A little bit of kudos here because is it Sergio Roberto who yes. just makes sure that he doesn't go to ground? Mancio. Mariano in the middle, so to his basket. So to gets away from Nacho. Gets the cross in! Vidal with the header, Dembélé with the cross, brilliant football from Barca, 5-1, four minutes to go, and Julen Lopetegui, head down, hands in pockets, leaves the technical area and heads back into the dugout, 5-1 to Barcelona, Vidal with the fifth. Steve, don't you regret saying that Dembélé might come on and change this game now because he's done practically nothing apart from that. Medo bent his run and waited. The linesman definitely stayed, put his flag up. Here's the save. It goes straight as an it's evening for Julian Lopetegui. Mariana returning it. And Benzema rubbing salt into Madrid's wound there as he drags that one. Suarez. In closing moments of the game. There it is, the yeah. final whistle. One of those historic score lines. Football Club Barcelona 5, Real Madrid 1. Managers straight to one.